our, our home state. Uh, we're going to Black Mountain, North Carolina. All right. Oh, the title of the article <laughs> reads, Veterans Step In to Stop Alleged Serial uh, Bank Robber in Car Chase with Police. Kelvin Wayne Simmons allegedly robbed multiple banks in North Carolina with a Despicable Me lunchbox. This is true. This is true. And this is recent. This he was just arrested last month, June 4th. All right. Three military veterans reportedly helped nab an alleged serial bank robber in North Carolina who was driving the wrong way down an interstate. Kelvin Wayne Simmons, 53, was arrested last Thursday in Black Mountain by U.S. Marshals following a string of bank robberies throughout the state. Simmons, who was accused of robbing banks in five North Carolina cities since May 25th, allegedly instigated a high-speed, 115-mile-per-hour police chase near the small mountain town and crashed into other cars on I-40 after attempting to carjack a woman and evade law enforcement. He reportedly let two passengers out of the car before the chase. Simmons allegedly robbed each bank while brandishing a Despicable Me lunchbox. He was planning to rob a bank in Black Mountain, according to police, and had outstanding warrants in five North Carolina counties. Army veteran Trevor Hugh told the local outlet that he and two other veterans were able to pull Simmons from the vehicle. He crashed and immobilized him until the police arrived. He allegedly was attempting to carjack an elderly woman. I said... Get the car and park because I was worried about him escaping and running me and the woman over. He told WLOS. When I had him on the ground, he was reaching behind, trying to reach under him. I assessed at one point he did have a gun and he was reaching for it. But during the auto accidents that he caused, at some point, perhaps he lost his weapon. Police reportedly have not revealed whether Simmons had a weapon, but he told WLOS that Simmons' attitude changed after he informed him that his situation would rapidly change if he produced a weapon. He stopped, and his demeanor very much was, I need water, I don't feel well, he said. (laughs) The real story is, there was an elderly woman getting carjacked, and citizens went into action, said Black Mountain Police Chief Steve Parker, according to WLOS. Obviously, we always say you have to use caution and be careful, but they stepped up and could have maybe saved a life and stopped somebody who's a dangerous criminal. All right. That has been your F-O-F-O, excuse me, F-A-F-O for this week in which a veteran had to teach a civilian a lesson. And in this case, three veterans taught Mr. Uh, Simmons here that uh, he fucked around and found out that he ran into the wrong group of guys. Salute. Uh, 